Okay, uh, we're going to build our flavor profile um, using um, Eats Barbecue Zero to Hero. A rub, we're going to put down a nice layer of that. I think it does a great job. Put down a and you don't have to go overboard with this, but where you cake it on, always leave something for the end. I'm gonna use that. And I love Ryle's um, Honey Chipotle. This is what I really love. We're gonna, we're gonna sprinkle this on here. Ryle's Honey Chipotle. A little bit over here. And we're gonna flip this over like this. Flip this over. And we're gonna use our use our brush and we're using we're using um, I used to use like peanut oil or a canola oil. This is a canola oil. I use this on here. Um, uh, to help uh, be an agent to make my rub stick as a binder. So we're going to sprinkle this down and always be sure you shake up your um, rubs because they do settle and sometimes cake up like this is done a little bit, but we'll get it right. All right, this on, and then we'll go back with Ryle's uh, Honey Chipotle, put that on. And we're gonna let this sweat a little bit, let it soak in, and then we'll We'll get it on the, get it on the, we're cooking on the, the high land today. So we'll be right back. Here we are, we're right here at the, um, the Highland Reverse Flow. We're getting ready to put this on. Uh, we're running about 3.30 on our temp gauge. So I already have tested the, the temp zones in the cook chamber and I know we're running right at about 275 280 degrees so we're gonna sit you can see the ribs right aren't those pretty can you see them those are beautiful ribs so we're getting ready to set these on right here and we're gonna let them go this is gonna be a good cook. These ribs, see what we can do. See if we can make some uh, an offering that could go in a competition box. All right, we'll talk to you when we get these ribs cooked up. Okay, we're almost at the end of our cook. The Highland has done its job. It's held its uh, temperature. And let's see where we are. We just put these ribs back on here to kind of set the bar, I mean, set the sauce on it. We're gonna take them inside and trim them up. And we'll give our um, critique of them. Great little cooker. Uh, the reverse flow. It's a nice little cooker. Uh, Oklahoma Joe reverse flow. I really enjoy cooking on this cooker. All right, we're going to take this inside and we're going to trim it up. Okay, this is the finished product. Beautiful rib. Nice and meaty and juicy. Let me take a test bite. Mmm. And that's where I, that's a bone from way out on the end 
but it's good. Delicious. And this is the finished product for the two racks. We got 10 bones and they are delicious. Good smoke, nice heat, good flavor, tender, just delicious. I hope you enjoyed this video. Be sure if you're watching on YouTube, hit the subscribe button. If you're on Facebook, just give me a like and go to my YouTube channel and um, subscribe. I'm at 50 uh, subscribers now. We're trying to reach 100. We just started our YouTube channel and just beginning to get videos up. So join us. Thank you for watching.